But I was, I was having a conversation with this white businessman in South Africa. And this white businessman says to me, oh, how is politics in Zimbabwe? You know, if you are Zimbabwean, everywhere you go, the first thing you have to do when a conversation begins is you have to defend your country. If you're Zimbabwean, anywhere you go, so what's going on in Zimbabwe? You don't know, but because you know, you know. So I'm speaking to this white businessman. He's telling me, telling me, and then it dawned on me that how come white people don't care that much about politics? But yet their lives thrive better than Zimbabweans or black people who are obsessed with politics. Why is that? How do we get to that place where you've got so many black people obsessed with politics, white people barely obsessed, but they are absolutely thorough in benefiting from politics. So it became clear. I then understood how it works. We are so concerned about getting people into office. White people are more interested in you making up your mind and once you get someone in office and they're at the top, white people will simply say, who is at the top? We are dealing with that person. So they've minimized their headaches. So they have way less a headache than we do uh, and that's why I think I'm that's what I learned while I was in South Africa.